it is me and my tea and my uh -huh, owl crate box. Woohoo! This is the October Wield Your Blade box and I'm super, super excited to get into it because I think some of my favorite fandoms are going to be in here if the spoilers are correct. So with trusty pocket knife, I shall wield my blade and get into it, shall we? Now, if you are not familiar with Owl Crate, it is a really fun monthly YA subscription box, and every month you get a brand new book signed by the author and some fun bookish goodies. So, let's see what we have in here. Uh -huh, you're the first to see. Ooh. So, first things first, as River Song would say, spoilers. We have this month's spoiler card with some lovely art on it and our spoilers on the back, but we shall save those for later. And the first thing I see are my kitten's favorite thing, paper wormies. Oh, she's being so cute right now. Do you want to see how cute she's being? One moment, tease. Look at you being so adorable watching me. I know, once those paper wormies are on the ground, you are going to be all over here, aren't you? Thank you for that kitten break. We are now back to our regularly scheduled unboxing. She is so cute. Okay, so first thing I see is this really beautiful purple tin. And it says, all legends have a spark of truth. <gasps> oh my gosh. And inside we have a little miniature sewing repair kit. So we have measuring tape, tiny scissors, some buttons and notions, and several different kinds of thread. This is so cool. And this, of course, is for Anna Thimble. This is from um, Spin the Dawn, which is one of my favorite Owl Crate books I've ever gotten and read. And so this is so cool. And I shall definitely travel with this because you never know when you'll need to repair something. All right, up next, we have a lo lovely big box with some artwork on it. And it says, not all those who wander are lost. And we all know where that quote is from, don't we? Oh, wow. So this is an item from Lord of the Rings. Oh, my gosh. This is so cool. So in here we have this beautiful bit of artwork. Oops, if I can get it on the right direction. There we are. Here, I think I shall find something a bit easier to read it with. So here it is. It is a wonderful quote from the Lord of the Rings. And it says, All that is gold does not glitter, not all those who wander are lost. The old that is strong does not wither, deep roots do not reach, are, do not, are not reached by the frost. From the ash of fire shall be awoken, a light from the shadow shall be spring, rewarded all, renewed shall be blade that was broken, and the crownless again shall be king. Oh, that is awesome. I love anything Lord of the Rings or Tolkien, so that's going to go right here. Yay! So up next, ah, that's what was rattling around, we have, and why the box smells so good, we have a candle, which must mean that it is fall time for Owl Creek because it is now candle season again. Ooh, so this is a persimmon, citrus, and nectarine scented um, candle, and I believe this is from um, Shadow of the Fox. And it smells really fresh and sweet mm, and very wonderfully citrusy peachy kind of a scent so that is very nice cannot wait to have that going on a cold winter's night or fall's night oh so next we have a puzzle to put together very interesting so here's the back of it and so this is a 300 piece puzzle Ooh. oh i think this is um strange the dreamer if i remember right Possibly. I shall look at the spoiler card later. And up next, ooh, more paper wormies. Ooh. So up next, we have this month's pin. So here we have this month's pin, and it says, 
the heart is not a weakness and it has this really neat sword very nice okay up next in our box ooh, we have an art print and I bet you cannot guess what fandom this is from any guesses yes it is Star Wars so we see Rey and Kylo Ren very very nicely done artwork that is really quite nice I like that and I like that it is nice and big so that will definitely be going on display with my Doctor Who Star Wars sci-fi shelf all right next thing we have in our box is our book so first off we have our letter from the author and our book which is so gorgeous here we have Jade Fire Gold and the most incredibly beautiful green sprayed edges emerald green oh my gosh this is so gorgeous and let's see if we have any goodies on the inside oh, double goodie we have a reversible dust jacket art so we have dragon and a phoenix on it oh that is absolutely beautiful and we have gilding on the cover of the book and like I said it is my only weakness it is my gildy pleasure haha <laughs> wow this book is so so stunning so let's see, see our inside we have of course signed by the author and let's see what this book is about so sorry if I mispronounce any of these names on is no one found as a child she has no memory of her past only a dark secret magical powers that would mean her imprisonment if they were discovered but when on's secret is accidentally exposed she is sent to the imperial palace to await her fate alton's real alton altans altans real name was once known throughout the she empire when his family was murdered and his birthright hijacked, he lost everything. Now, with a new name and vengeance on his mind, he intends to gain it all back, even if it means entangling his very soul with dark and dangerous magic from which he might never escape. When Alton encounters An and her mysterious ability, he sees in her a path to reclaim the throne. Their tenuous alliance is on the verge of becoming something more, when the depths of An's dark powers are awakened, and the two realize that restoring the Empire might come at a far deadlier price than they could have ever imagined. Ooh. So this sounds like it's going to be quite the epic adventure. So, let's see, we are down to our last two things in our box. So, we have, of course, our monthly newsletter, which I absolutely love. Because we have interview with the author, we have the Owl Crate edition cover and the original, and I think I really like the green a lot more than just the standard, like, fiery red gold color. I think that really makes the cover pop. We have some book, some apps for book lovers, other book recommendations, interview with an items vendor, Instagram photo challenge, Spotify playlist and some other books that are coming out this month and I'm really excited for this one because I have a special edition of When the Night Breaks that will be arriving soon and I cannot wait to read that and of course we have next month's theme which is da, 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 Dreaming in the Dark and this is super cute artwork on here and it says that every box will include an item designed by Book Babe Designs and I really like their designs. They have such great artwork. Oh, I absolutely love them. And spoilers, I do know that next month is going to have, I believe, the last of our Darker Shade of Magic tins. And it's also going to have a yearly item that everyone gets super excited for. Can you guess? If you're planning books for next year, it might be super helpful. Hint, hint. Well, everybody, I hope that you have enjoyed this video, and if you are interested in checking out another video, go ahead and click right here. And if you're new, welcome to my channel, and go ahead and click that subscribe button and the bell so you never miss my videos ever again. And thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye! And a quick correction, the puzzle is actually the Raven Cycle and 
called Down the Hawk. Thanks so much for watching.